Hi my dear kids in this video we are going to see chapter 6 air and water from MTG workbook of class 1 NSO. So we know air is all around us. We cannot see it but we can feel it. Moving air is called wind. Wind helps to dry clothes, move sailboats, spread seeds to new places etc. Next properties of air. So air fills up space. Air is all around us. Even an empty glass is actually full of air. Next, air gives shape to things. When we blow air inside a balloon, it gives balloon its shape. All living things need air to breathe. You can feel air going out of your nose and going inside your nose. Air is needed for burning. In villages, Women keep fanning air while cooking to keep fire burning in the chulhas. Air has weight. Weight of a flattened football increases when it is filled with air. Okay. Different forms of air. Wind. Moving air is called wind. Breeze. Slow moving wind is called breeze. Storm. Very fast moving wind. That mostly comes with rain, thunder and lightning is called storm. Next to water. All living things need water to survive. It comes from rain. It exists as ice, water and vapor. Rain water fills river, lakes and ponds. Water can be stored in dams, wells etc. We should not waste water. Okay. Next uses of water. Cooking food, washing utensils, washing clothes, bathing, drinking, putting out fire. Now let's see the practice questions. First, football and tire are filled with dash. Water, air, sand and fire. So football and tire are filled with air. So option B is the correct answer. Okay, option B. Second one, dash is the underground source of water. Option A, river. B. Pond. C. Well. D. Dam. So, underground sources of water are those which draw water from below the ground such as wells, hand pumps, tube wells, etc. So, option C. Well is an underground source of water. Third one. All of the following activities can be done with the help of air except dash. Blowing up a balloon, it can be done with the help of air. Be burning wood, it also done with the help of air. Irrigating a field, irrigating a field is done with the help of water. Next, drying wet cloths, it also can be done with the help of air. So, all of the following activities can be done with the help of air. Except irrigating a field. So option C is the correct answer. Okay. Option C irrigating a field. Fourth one. Select the object which can be used to show that air moves things. So out of the following option. Feather. Feather can be used to show that air moves things. So option A is the correct answer. Fifth one. What is X in the given figure? Okay. What is X in the given figure. So X represents water vapor or steam. Water vapor or steam. So option B is the correct answer. Okay. Option B. Sixth one. Unscramble the following letter groups to find out the name of a water source. So on unscrambling we get option A smoke and then option B hand pump. And then option C, dust. Then option D, mug. So out of these, hand pump, okay. Hand pump is a water source. So option B is the correct answer, okay. Option B. Seventh one, we need water to option A, cook food, yes. Wash clothes, yes. Mob flows, yes. So we need water to all of these activities, so, option D is the correct answer. Okay, option D. Eighth one. 
match the columns and select the correct option. So column 1 R. So R is nothing but all around us. So A4. So either option B or C will be the correct answer. Wind moving air. So C is incorrect. B is the correct answer. Blow up balloon. Air takes up space. Storm. Fast and strong wind. So A4, B1, C2 and D3. So option B is the correct answer. Okay, option B. Ninth one. Savitri is mopping floor. Which of the following would help her in better and faster cleaning? Option A. Dry mop and still air. No. B. Wet mop and still air. No. C. Dry mop and moving air. No. Wet mop and moving air. Yes. So, Savitri is mopping floor. Wet mop and moving air help her in better and faster cleaning. So, option D is the correct answer. Tenth one. Which of these words does not rhyme with any water body present on earth? So, clue, bond, pond. So, option is shiver. It can be rhyme with river. Shiver, river. And then cake, it can rhyme with lake. Cake, lake. See, bug. So, there is no rhyming word with any bug. Bring, spring. Okay, bring, spring. So, option C is the correct answer. Okay, option C. Shiver, river, cake, lake, bring, spring. Bug does not rhyme with any water body. So, option C is the correct answer. 11th one. Which of the following is a use of water? People go to water park to relax and enjoy. Yes. B. Water is used for putting out fire. Yes. We need water to drink. Yes. Option D. All of these. So, option D. All of this is the correct answer. Okay. Option D. 12th one. Which of the following activities can come at the place X? Can come at the place X. So, X is the activity. It needs both water and air. So, option A, moving things. B, drying clothes. C, irrigating field. D, cleaning utensils. So, drying clothes need air. Irrigating field need water. Cleaning utensils need water. So, moving things, it need both water and air. Water moves a boat and air moves a parachute or kite. So, option A, moving things need both water and air. So, option A is the correct answer. Thirteenth, select the option that arranges these natural water bodies in an increasing order of size. So, first puddle. Second pond, third lake, last biggest water body is ocean. Okay, so 4, 2, 3, 1. Option B is the correct answer. Okay, option B. 14th, look at the activities shown in the given figure. So, please pause the video and please check the given figure. Select the correct option regarding it. It shows that R gives shape to things. Yes, R gives shape to things. B. It shows that R occupies space. Yes, it shows that R occupies space. C. It shows that R exerts pressure. It shows that R exerts pressure. So, option D. All the options are correct options regarding the above figure. So, option D is the correct answer. Fifteenth, the given figure shows that. So, please again pause the video and please check the given figures. So, blown up ball is heavier than the blown out ball. Okay. So, the given figure shows that blown up ball is heavier. Option C is the correct answer. Next, achiever section. Sixteenth, Richard did an activity as shown below. So, she took an empty glass, she tilted the glass and slowly pushed it down into the tub of water. She observed bubbles coming out of the glass. 
what does this activity show so the empty glass is filled with air yes b water displaces air in the glass yes c air comes out of the water in the form of bubbles yes so option d all of this is the correct answer this activity shows that empty glass is filled with air and water displaces air in the glass and air comes out of the water in the form of bubbles so option d is the correct answer 17th one of the three things which makes the air dirty is given in the given word grid find the names of the other two things and match them with the pictures of their respective sources so a germs a germs so a3 b smoke okay b smoke and then c dust so d is the one dust so c1 and then smoke s yes, m o k e so b2 so a3 a3 yes a3 b2 c1 so option d is the correct answer okay so this one is germs this one release smoke and this one release dust so option d is the correct answer 18th air has water vapors this can be noticed more clearly on which of these days so air has water vapor this can be noticed more clearly on misty days okay more clearly on misty days so option c is the correct answer 19th select the incorrect match so first column air component next source next effect or role okay so option a oxygen source for oxygen is plants and it is needed for burning things it is the correct match b smoke source for smoke factories vehicles etc it makes the air dirty so it is also correct match c germs source sunlight they can make us fall ill it is incorrect because sun gives us light and heat and it is not the source of germs so option c is incorrect match d water vapor source rice lake sea ocean etc on cooling they form tiny drops of water so we need to select the incorrect match so option c is the correct answer okay option c 20 complete the following paragraph by choosing the correct sequence of words we all need dash to live so we all need air and water to live so it seems all the options are correct next clean water should not be throw drunk wasted wasted so clean water should not be wasted so either option c or d will be the correct plants need water to grow or wilt so plants need water to grow so option d is incorrect loss of water can cause a plant to, to wilt so option c is the correct answer we all need water to live clean water should not be wasted plants need water to grow loss of water can cause a plant to wilt so option c is the correct answer okay option c thank you my dear kids for watching this video if you like this video please like and subscribe in our next video we are going to see chapter 7 weather and the sky please check the playlist for more videos thank you